Guys, happy, happy, happy New Year! It's January 1st, 2019, and of course, we have to start the year right. So, another day, another gala, and this time we're here in Baguio. So, this is my second time here in Baguio, and first stop namin is Strawberry Farm. I'm super happy because it's not crowded. So. Wala nang gaanong tourists. So, hindi kami makapag strawberry picking today kasi wala pang gaanong bunga. Hindi pa bloomed masyado yung strawberries. Good morning! Happy New Year! Happy, Happy New Year! Happy New Year! Lolo, hello! <laughs> Dali, anong post? <laughs> Anyways, outside strawberry farm. Super dami ng souvenir shops. There are also fruit shops. Two kilometers away from Strawberry Farm is the famous na Bahay Bahay, which is known as the Stavosa Mural. And ito siya. Wow. Area where you can wear ethnic attire, and then here, but in portrait sketching, boy, at Maduna. We just made it to the top, pababa na kami kasi umuula na. Mommy, so 100 steps yan from there going. Up there. Wow. <laughs> Daddy. No, so babala ng Lord is Grotto is merong ethnic, para ethnic costume that you could rent for just 20 pesos. Hey guys, so it is around 12 noon and we just finished eating lunch. Tapos we proceeded here sa PMA where you can see yung mga tanks and even yung mga barrel. I don't know what you call it. Or yung machine guns na ginamit nila during World War. You guys could tell na super tagal na ng tank na to. Kasi sa parts pa lang nila, makikita na na super luma na niya. Ayun na, may mga sirang parts. So we're currently in Camp Chan. Hey. Pero mo alam so din na kami makakalabas. Sayang. Moments later. As of 10 p.m., ganyan kadami yung tao. Look at those guys. Super dami tao. Shopping sa night market. I'm gonna show you yung lap mga na pamilya ko. Koti lang naman if meron na ako time. And with my Hi guys, good morning. Day two and last day here in Baguio. I wasn't able to show you guys in transient na pinagstaya namin overnight kasi nga pagkatating na pagkatating pagkatating na pagkatating namin is natulog lang kami agad. Then after that, we woke up just to go to the night market and then natulog again. And then I'll show you guys our transient. Lo, lo, lo. Malamig la. Good morning, Dad. Good morning. We are staying at one of the transients here in Camp Allen. Tapos, meron lang parking outside and si Zach. And then, naka-open lang yung gates. And we safe naman daw dito. And then, our transient is here. Staying at room for zero two. This is just a small transient, guys. We have two rooms and then the toilet. Then we have... A chair here, and then the TV, which is color green. Yung pelabas bakit kanya? Merong sink, and then dispenser. They also have plates that you can use. The kettle, and then the ref, which is working. And then outside we have this view. And then malapit lang palakami guys sa Burnham Park, and then the night market. 
merong way dito pero kailangan mo lang maglakad hindi kaya yung sasakyan hey guys so we're back at Camp Chan hey it's 10 in the morning so bumalik talaga kami kasi sayang naman yung punta namin if hindi namin siya lilibutan ito talaga yung dinayo namin here in Camp Chan hey yung treetop huw hiningal ako adventure <laughs> so good that merong parang bazaar dito sa gilid Kelly our weakness <laughs> Guys, so ito yung Treat Up Adventure. Maraming sila in-offer. Merong canopy ride, Superman ride, Treat Up Adventure, Silver Surfer ride, and then Skywalk and Trekking. Nasa loob na kami ng Treat Up Adventure. Meron siyang, who is CR? Meron siyang admission fee of 100 pesos. Okay, buhit sa lahat eh, CR. Meron siyang admission fee which is 100 pesos. Tapos we will be taking yung canopy ride which is 250 pesos. So ilalas yung 100 pesos admission fee dun sa canopy ride na 250 pesos. So ayan, natataka na rin kami. So we got the ticket. Tapos kailangan bumaba kasi nasa baba na yung harness. So it's up to the harness kung saan kayo magsistart from top or from baba. on top. Tapos ayun yung canopy. Next na kami. Yay! I'm on top. So I think this is around 60 to 70 feet if I'm not mistaken. Ang saya! <laughs> We're almost done sa first station. Next station going there. That's a better lighting. There you go. Okay guys, we're done with the second part and then last one na. Ito, nandun na papunta sa pavilion. Woo! We're done. That's around 10 to 15 minutes canopy ride. Good shepherd! Sana? There. Ay, galamig. Ice cream. Kahit malamig. <laughs> Yung mga horse dito, imagine for how long a day na nagsistay silang ganyan, iba-iba yung sumasakay. It is 3.13pm. Umalis na kami sa Mindspeed Park kasi sobrang dami tao. As in, sobrang dami. At kanina, wala naman yung mga yun. Right Park. The mansion na sobrang daming tao. Mm, takbo, takbo, takbo. <laughs> Botanical Garden is open daily from 8 a.m. to 9 p.m. Ang dami nung paakit ng Baguio. Bye, Baguio! Guys, look at those clouds! Ay, hindi kita! Sobrang fog! Landslide! Hey guys, it's Calzon. There you go, you're at the end of this video where I'll be showing you guys lahat ng napamili ko from Baguio. Specifically, the night market which is in Harrison Road. By the way guys, it is open daily starting from 9pm onwards. Just a little background, pumunta kami na Baguio first week of January. Baguio's night market has a lot to offer. From tops to bottoms to skirts, jackets, pants, thermal suits, and all those stuff. Sobrang dami sa Baguio. As in, sobrang dami mo pwedeng mabili with just 100 pesos, 50 pesos, meron ka ng jacket. I know Baguio's night market is like an ukay-ukay but fortunately, yung isa kong nabili, I mean, dalawa kong nabili from night market. I feel like it's brand new kasi nung binili ko pa siya, meron pa siyang tag price. I don't know if it's legitimately brand new or dinikit na lang I don't know. No idea. Anyways, if you want to see the stuff that I got from the night market, please keep on watching. First thing that I got is this really big coat. I'm not so sure but this is how it looks like. I only got this for 100 pesos. This is what I was talking about earlier. Yung meron pa siyang tag price. It's from the brand Gallery Woman. 
And it says here, it's made in Indonesia. Yung isang bagay lang na ayoko sa kanya is mabigat siya. Next thing that I got, actually guys, tatlo lang talaga yung nabili ko from the night market because we were in a rush kasi my dad was not feeling well that night so kailangan talaga namin umalis agad ang night market so there's a reason for me to go back to Baguio. The next thing that I got from the night market is this one. It's a gray bonnet with a fur fur on top and then alongside with that is this one, a black, black, a white lace hat. Actually looks like this, and then there's another ribbon in here. I actually have a different way of how I'll be wearing this one. Because that night I was looking for a braid. If you guys know what a braid is, this is how it definitely looks like. Ayan, parang ganyan. Tong hard part na to inside. I'll put it inside, and then ayan, then this. Ayan. Yun yung way ko siya susuot nito talaga. So, brog cute dito guys in person. I super love this one. This one is 50 pesos and then this one is only 35 pesos. 50 pesos talaga to guys, tinawaran ng ni mommy. So, yeah, 35 pesos. Not bad. Guys, I almost forgot. Hindi pa na 3 items lang yun ako from the night market. It's actually 4. So, the 4th item is this skirt. Long, very, very long skirt. It's high waist and it has garter at the back. And what I really love about this one is yung pockets niya na parehong side meron. Ayan. And I only got this for, guess what? 50 freaking pesos. And then, meron lang akong i-add. This is not from the night market. There was a bazaar dun sa Camp Chanhe in Tree Top Adventure area. So, yeah. Nakita ko tong jacket na to. The color, the feels. Ah, sobrang ganda. Anyways, this is how it looks like. Ayan. It's a long coat. It's a long sleeve. Long coat and this is kind of pricey guys. I don't have any plans of buying it pero my mom insisted that I should get it. My mom got me this one kasi nga ayaw ko siyang bilhin. This was for 490 pesos pero bawad kami so 400 pesos na lang siya. Medyo pricey lang talaga siya kaya ayaw ko siyang bilhin. Anyway, so that is basically everything that I got from Baguio. Specifically the night market and a bazaar from Camp Chan. Hey, siguro if mapapansin nyo, puro pang malamig yung binili ko. Like bonnets, jackets, coat. Eh, mahinit naman dito sa Pinas. Simply because I'm really, really hopeful that I get to travel in countries na malalamig. Advance lang tayo mag-isip. <laughs> Everyone knows how expensive a thermal jacket, a coat is in malls. Parang nagre-range siya from what? 1,000 pesos. So, kalang maging practical. I just realized na nakabuo pala ako ng isang winter outfit. Well, two winter outfits. I encourage you guys to visit the Harrison Road Night Market if you're gonna travel in Baguio. Sobrang worth it, guys. And sobrang daming good finds. Sobrang daming murang bilihin. So, I really suggest that you roam around. So, that is basically it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed our Baguio trip. Well, we really enjoyed that time. If you guys like this kind of videos, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Please do subscribe to my channel. Also, hit the notification bell so you won't miss out whenever I upload a new video. Again, thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you drop by again soon. Bye!